Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration Reading for all the Liberals, Sun, Moon and Rising sign for the second week of August 2017 and we have the energy of the lovers and the energy of the lovers is a wonderful energy. It's a week of emotion but it can be good emotions. We have so many different things happen, happening for you guys in this week and it's going to be wonderful. Whatever the situation is, we need to understand that the universe has placed these situation in our ways and we just need to learn to work with them okay so we have the energy of the lovers in this week and with the energy of the lovers we have the um zodiac energy vibration of the fire and this is going to be wonderful because whatsoever is happening there is going to be a cleansing for you air sign people and um as I look at your reading there is absolutely no energy vibration that is going to support you in this week I want to say thank you to each and every person for returning thank you for the likes and shares thank you for the support it has been wonderful it has been so wonderful and I'm so grateful for all the support that um, I've been receiving for the channel thank you for um, you know being such a positive positive uh, um, group uh, you librans okay all right um please leave your messages and remember to listen to your sun moon and rising sign because this is very important let's see what you have because you have a lot of it's a week of work I can say that it's a week of regrets also but it's a week of work we have the Queen of Cups coming up in the reading, whatever um, this is. So there is this sort of an energy that is there. So let's see what else we have to deal with. It's a lot of work. Whatever is going on, it's a lot of work. We have a lot of work and uh, um, loss, but yet still a loss with something good. We have the energy of the devil. But we're going to work around that and we have the energy of the lovers coming back in this week and the energy of the world so it is going to be good whatever is happening your focus is going to be the seven of wands the energy of the seven of wands is a really really wonderful energy because what is happening is that you're protecting yourself from um negative um influence that is around you and this is good because um it is also a good energy for um, work whatever is happening you are really protecting yourself you are really going to that um, a sense of doing your best in whatever endeavor you are doing this week so it's going to be a wonderful positive week you have nothing to worry about honestly you're going to be seeing a lot of changes coming in but it's going to be good because what is happening is that you're protecting yourself okay what is happening in this week is that we have um the energy of uh, the eight of wands eight of wands so good news a lot of news will be coming in a lot of positive news will be coming in um this is good and it's all about money so you have the six of pentacles on Monday so this is good because what is happening is that um, if you are looking for work you are going to get a lot of invitations coming in a lot of people um, asking you um, to connect with them if you have your home business you're going to see a lot of um, uh, business coming in a lot of clients coming in so this is going to be wonderful on Monday so whatever is happening on Monday it's going to be a stable day for you because you're an air sign and this energy is actually have to do with work and money work and finance so this is going to be on Monday a positive day because whatever is happening gifts will be coming in if you're not working gifts will be coming in little gifts people will be supporting you whatever it is whatever your endeavor is people are going to be opening up and supporting you on Monday so this is good as we move forward we have only 
one major arcano that is the prominent energy and we have the energy of the chariot energy of the chariot is wonderful because whatever is happening with the energy of the chariot you're moving forward and most of you uh, are going to be connecting with uh, the energy of uh, the king of cups which is the pisces a cancer a scorpion and this is good the energy of the chariot is always a leo a fire sign person it's always movement so whatever is happening in your work and endeavors you're going to be extremely triumphant air over we're going to see some um, energies of potential of uh, um, promotion and that sort of a thing um, people are going to get new promotions some people are going to have the energy vibration of this uh, um, man who is a Pisces a cancer a scorpion who is going to help you to move forward in your life and this is going to be extremely positive it doesn't really matter how you look at it is going to be a very very positive energy so this is going to be good in work and if you are um, looking for a business partner this 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 um, whoever this page of cups is is going to help you he's going to bring you to the place that you need to be in your life at this time and this this person is going to support you to move you um, to some place that is better but yet some place that is much more fruitful in within your life and fruitful within you and your energy vibration so this is going to be positive so whatever is happening expect to be moving um, movement is here in this week and it's moving in the right direction here we go again with another one card. so it's going to be a fight fire energy for you on Wednesday in the middle of the week so this whole week is uh, being crowned by um, the energy of fire and it's all about business it's all about your passion so if you're not working if you haven't got your home business it's all about passion it's all about finding your passion and here you are for the five of one so there will be a little bit of conflicts but this conflicts will not be it's, it's, it's have to do with you but it's not going to affect you um, because what is happening is that whatever the conflict is it can be conflicts around you but it's not affecting you um, it can be people trying to create a chaos around you but it's absolutely not going to affect you and here we have uh, um, the energy vibration of this um, Knights of Cups and this Knight of Cups is coming in. Whatever he's doing, he's coming in because something is happening and he wants to help you. Um, for this, um, this Knight of Cups is between the ages of 18 and 35. And it's going to affect you in the sense that if you're a woman, this person at your work is going to either have an this person at your work is either going to have an um, um, admirer for some of you and for some of you it's going to be somebody who's working against you but it's not really working against you is that sometimes people can like you and you're not aware of it and then you know it's as if they're pushing you to another level and you're thinking you know why is this person is doing this so it's this sort of a thing um if you're not working it's going to be an energy that um somebody is coming in with a lot of sweet talk so you have to be aware of this person but it's going to be good because it's, it's not bad um this person can also create the energy vibration of chaos because um, they might want to be with you and you're in a relationship so that that sort of a thing is going to happen but it's going to be a good week because uh, you your week is actually surrounded and protected by this energy as we move forward we have the energy vibration of the five of cups the five of cups this five of cups is really a wonderful five of cups where you have looked it's you're going to take the time to look and see how far you have come and see all the things that have happened but yet still you're standing up and you're being so positive with whatever situation that comes your way and this is going to be good because you're going to end up with an happy outcome 
whatever the outcome was whatever that you have felt that has been lost it is not lost because um, it's as if the energy vibration is going to turn around and it's going to change and it's going to be wonderful so if you had thought that you have lost the promotion lost the space didn't get a job because of something didn't get something in your life that you really needed have lost something that you have always wanted and now it is it's, it's, there's going to be a change coming up because you're going to really realize that that's not the case the case this is going to be a wonderful whatever is happening on Thursday it's going to be a wonderful energy vibration of connecting with things that you realize oh my god this is it's just going to be a surprise because you thought you lost something but actually uh, you have gained something which is much better than what you have okay we're moving forward to Friday and Friday we have the nine of Pentacles and whatever the energy of the nine of Pentacles always bring a lot of love money gifts gifts of money this is going to be a lot of money whatever and whoever you are um, money is going to come to you so this is going to have to do with people who are looking for studies um, student loan and that sort of a thing money for investments uh, money for help uh, personal help but it's all about wherever this money is coming from it could be that some people will be winning the lottery on Friday because the energy of the devil is here it can be a gamble whenever you gamble and that sort of a thing that's when um, the energy of money comes with the energy of the devil so you know there's going to be so, so much different aspect and so much different things that will be happening that is bringing in this nine of Pentacles but it can also be that people were or there's someone trying you know as if they know that you're going to receive this money and trying to make all these um, extra things and extra this you should pay an extra that and that sort of a thing so be aware of whatever is happening on Friday but Friday is going to be good because it could be also for the people who are getting paid um, bi-weekly and that sort of a thing so it's going to be a positive energy is okay as we look at Saturday we have the energy of the Pentacles and the energy of water so here is a good balance and what we have we have the four of pentacles which is so wonderful the four of pentacles is that you're holding on to your materialistic possession and there's nothing wrong with it there's absolutely nothing wrong with it it is a time when you're trying to protect certain aspect of yourself and certain aspect of your material world so you know it could be that someone says okay let's go out and do something or you're thinking no i need to balance out my financial situation I need to spend less or that sort of a thing and people will look at you because you have the energy of uh, um, the lovers so this and it's on Saturday so maybe you know your partner wants to go out to your partner wants to go do something or your partner wants to you know buy a new car or get something new or you know and you're thinking no I need to really save so and it can also be for some people that um, you and your partner are looking at your finance and trying to balance out your financial situation um, in the month uh, in, in this weekend so it's it's actually a positive thing because whenever you know some people always you know break up in relationships um, over money and um, have arguments over money but it's not going to be that energy it's going to be a very, very positive energy it's going to be something that you know you know your your partner and yourself decided that you know we want to go on this vacation we want to have this for Christmas we want to do this and you guys are really talking about it that you're going to give out less and that sort of a thing um, it can be also that you're trying to refinance and you're thinking okay if we refinance and we and we get just one loan for certain things that sort of a thing is going to happen so it's going to be good on the Saturday whatsoever is happening okay we have the energy of the Queen of Cups and the Queen of Cups have been showing up in this week for whatever reason she has been showing up for this week and there is a situation that has happened so what happened is that you're going to be celebrating yourself from this Queen of Cups as if, as if whatever happened she had something to do with a situation in your life 
and you've finally gotten out and the world is going to be opening up for you now whatever she has done whatever lies she has told whatever she has done for some people it's going to be that the Queen of Cups is coming in to help you and to support you in whatever endeavor so it's going to you know with every energies because there's millions of you out there um, the Queen of Cups could be um, supporting you in different sort of a ways so it can be in a positive way and it can be in a negative way it can be that it was someone in your life and it could be your mom maybe your mom realized that she can open up doors for you and this is going to happen this is going to be extremely wonderful so whoever you are and whatever it is that you're looking for it's going to work out for you because there's going to come an end to the queen of cups whoever she is and then there is going to come out a positive positive uh, um, situation in your life again this week is all about the work it's all about work it's all about connecting with other people for the people whose parents are um, of a Pisces a cancer or a scorpion please connect with your parents in this week there is a situation a karmic situation that needs to be cleared up for whatever reason this has happened and whatever has happened there is a karmatic um, situation that needs to clear up so uh, be aware of the situation and you need to understand what is happening around you and understand where you are as um in, in this time because this week is a positive week uh, behalf of the energy of the devil here it's a positive week and whatever that has happened your financial situation work because of hard work and you're going to see that um, your financial situation is going to be changing um, what I see here is um, whatever is happening love is going to be the focal point Thursday is going to be the focal point of love the connection on Tuesday there could be a connection if you're looking for a partner but it's more of a victorious thing it's as if you're being victorious over the energy of uh, the king of cups and the king of cups is a Pisces a cancer or the scorpion there in this week you guys are working with a lot of um, the, the, the water people because they are the energy vibration of this week also and they're coming in and healing certain aspect of yourself so it's not bad it's actually a good week because the Pentacles is here because you have the earth energy on um, Saturday and you have uh, the water energy on Sunday but that water energy is the end of something that was happening and you're moving forward and by moving forward you have also in diagonal the energy of uh, um, um, triumph success whatever that you have been working against and you're moving away so a lot of people will find themselves moving so um, whatever the situation was and is you're going to find yourself moving to something better and the first half of the week what we had we had um, the eight of ones coming at us eight of ones with a six of Pentacles in the first half of the week and then we had the energy of the four of Pentacles and the lovers so these are very very good cards because your first half of the week and the triumphant energy is going to be the chariot with the king of cups okay so in the first half of the week it's going to be very wonderful very positive whatever is happening in the second half of the week we have the nine of Pentacles with the devil nine of Pentacles with the devil so there is a situation with the devil trying to block this money but it's not going to happen and then we have the energy of the Queen of Cups in another scenario that uh, some of you could be having a situation with her but it's going to be okay whatever it was it's coming to an end and something new is going to come out and the, out the result is going to be the five of cups but you'll be losing something small but gaining something which is much bigger and that is going to be positive because you could be changing careers you could be changing careers um, that that could be in the last part of the week for some people you could be changing careers whatever the career was that you have maybe you're changing career to do something else and you are going to see these sort of energy coming in so be aware of that this week is 
really a week of um, positive things whatever is happening it's a week of uh, um, positive things that are going to happen so um, whatever it is be aware of these situations around you okay so this is going to be good all right I'm working with another deck to see um, what energies would like to come out for you guys and you have the devil twice you have the devil twice so now I know why you were protecting yourself you're protecting yourself from situations that are going on around you because most of you are uh, liberals if you're working on the um, positive side I I, I uh, energy vibration you are protecting yourself from people who are working on a low energy vibration and I am seeing this a lot coming up lately so this is nothing this is not strange this is this is really a, an extreme positive situation that is going on and you are going to find yourself in a positive place in your life so it doesn't really matter um, what this energy is coming up for is because you have find a better place it's as if your soul has brought you to a better place in this week and it's going to be good it just doesn't really matter what is happening you know who you are and you know that um, positive situations are coming in your life and this is going to be good okay so we're going to go forward and we're going to look and see what does the ascend the ascension cards what should you think about the dolphins and this is good so I connect with the, the dolphin energies I connect with the dolphin energies and this is good because um, what a lot of people do not know is that by connecting with a dolphin energy I connect with a dolphin energy and it says the dolphin synchronous purified and raised the frequency of water as they swim through it so that they can access maintain and pass on the wisdom of the golden Atlantis and Lemuria those dolphin who simmers with the um, Aquarian light were the angels of Atlantis they are and might be beams who help to all the frequency of the ocean choosing the cards invite you to tune in to the beautiful dolphin and access a message from them your guidance is to relax and flow with the current of ascension knowing that the dolphins are telepathic imparting help and wisdom to you so this is going to be extremely good so here I am saying to each and every person have a wonderful wonderful week namaste